What's going on, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of The Council. We are back with the final episode, The Last Move. Uh, well, it's actually called Checkmate. <laughs> and there are three episodes. The final vote, mind jail, we did in the last episode, which I apologize for the weird cut at the end. I thought we had more to go, and it was the last choice at the end. I ended up missing some of that piece, but... I think you guys got the gist of it from there. And we're going to be going into the last move. So, we are in the Great Conclave Chamber. Let's see what happens here. Back with everybody else, I think. Yes. Ah. Uh, I... Where am I? It's alright, son. Don't panic. It's over. Uh, I'm back? Where are the guests? I invited them to go up to their room. They're resting. Don't worry. Resting as in Gregory? Sir Gregory is? We won, Louis. It's over. Good. He's dead? Definitively. Nice. Now the way is clear. At any rate, rejoice. Great things await us. What did you do to him? I devoured his soul. Holy you... hell. But I didn't see you use the Holy Lance. Indeed not. I didn't need to. Can't you guess how I did it? The Lance of Longinus is just a vessel, Louis. It could have been any object that had the blood of Christ on it. The blood of an ancient, more precisely. But I didn't need the blood of an ancient. You see, I have been in dear Lord Mortimer's physical body for longer than my brother has been in Sir Gregory Holmes. Oh. Therefore, I am an ancient, Louis. No kidding. Uh... He was your brother. Why did you kill him? He never meant you any harm. Oh, Louis. I, I am exhausted. Let's talk about this later. No, tell me why now. I want to understand. <sighs> Stubborn as a mule. After yeah, centuries just like you. of trying to convince him, I assure you I had no other option than to do away with him. He would never have allowed me to depose our father. In the past, he had already opposed me, and sometimes very violently. He seemed okay. to you like a man of peace, because you did not represent any danger to him. But I can assure you, he was not. With anything to do with our father, he would be merciless. He did seem case, shady. What's done is done. Yep, he did. I'm going to rest in the dining room. Join me there when you're ready. The right. time has come to end this little antisocial gathering. I did well not to follow home, didn't I? Come on, let's get it over with. Enjoy See. Mortimer in the dining room. I knew there was a reason why I didn't want to do it, man. I've always found that guy shady. So welcome back everybody. We are in the final stages of the game. Uh, can we oh no. I just want to keep looking around and see if I can find some more honey. Honey, honey. Oh, what's this? Damn. Nothing. Honey. Poof. It's in the dining room. Uh, he did say the guests were in their rooms. I wonder if we can actually go talk to any of them. Uh, first... Well, I guess we'll go in order. Sir Jacques Perru? Nope, not him. Monsieur Napoleon Bonaparte. Mr. Boner's hurt. No, he's, uh, he's on my side anyways. I wanted to talk to the people that were, at first... Objecting to me working with my father. Just Emily Hillsborough. Yes. I want to see if she knows anything about what went down, or if she maybe even knows anything about her sister. What are you doing over there? Uh, oh yeah, there's that. No. Ready? Looked at that. Oh, oh, what's this? Ah, oh, it's a reflection. Miss Duchess, where are you at, girl? Na, 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 na. A letter from William Pitt the Elder addressed to Emily. Who okay, so I guess Prime Minister. This letter dates from fifteen years ago now. Madam. I shall I shall never nope. Nada. Okay, I don't think we're supposed to be up here. We'll just go straight to see Mortimer. Or Papa. Or where was the dining room? It's not up here. Let's go back downstairs. Uh, yeah, we were there. 
we go? Was it here? Yes. Right. Now's the time to join Mortimer. I won't be able to go back after. Okay. Nope, not yet. That makes me wonder if there's something else we should have done. I'm going back upstairs. I want to check each and every one of the rooms I can just to see. Just because Duchess isn't there doesn't mean that the rest of them wouldn't be. Uh, like, Wolner might be there. Giuseppe might be there. Duchess Emily Hillsborough. Yeah. Okay, go around the corner. Duke Manuel Godoy. No, nope, he's not there. So, see, I could go into her room, but certain people now I can't that I used to be able to go into. Uh, that's my room. If anything, we could probably grab a few trinkets and such. Or at least a drink. Inferno by Dante. Nope. Abandon hope, all ye who enter here. Lovely lectures Mortimer is giving to his guests. Very jolly. For how ye are jolly, good fellow. Uh, nope, that's my letter. Nothing. Damn. Just really hoping I'd be able to get some juice. Apparently that's not going to be a thing. So let's head out. We'll go over to another person's room. Piaget. Nope. Can't do him. So there must be someone else. Well, I mean, it doesn't have to be. But there should be. Washington, no. What the hell was this? Oh yeah, Elizabeth. Oh yeah, that's her name tag now. Ow. Nope, just the same old letters. Yeah, I remember coming back here when we thought my mom was involved in the murders and she was involved in torturing, but she did not murder that lady. Okay, so not here. Huh. What the hell is this guy doing? What are you doing? Oh, Monsieur Volner asked me to prepare his belongings in anticipation of his imminent departure, sir. His departure? So quickly? Oh, yes, he seemed to be in rather a hurry. Yeah, I see. I thought so. Very well. Would you know where I might bump into him one last time? Ah, if sir would like to say goodbye, sir will find him in his room. See, Thank I you. I knew it. Von Volner. Yeah, baby. Johan. Louis. Uh, I haven't the time. You better make what are you it. What are doing? I'm getting out of here. What do you think? And going as far away as possible. Sir Gregory is dead. And in case you haven't grasped it yet, I am no longer safe here. If you value your life... Yeah, but you voted for Mortimer. Hey, hey, wait a no, second. No, no, I haven't time. Good luck in the future. Oh, you know something about the future? <laughs> well, what a dink. Uh, okay, go back in. All right, well... Sneak in the back door. Wonder if we could go. Oh no, that's the other room. Dante's Paradise. Yeah. Raise your head and be reassured. For what comes up here from the mortal world must ripen in our rays. Just wondering if maybe we could see or go some. What, what, what dinged? A Chinese coin. Oh. Recognizable by the hole in the middle. If I remember rightly, that's called a cash. And then maybe that's where the whole cash money came from. There ain't nothing in here. Uh, you know what? Since we're here. Let's check it out. Maybe we'll get some dirt on my papa. I don't think we'll be able to go into that back room or nothing, but... Oh, 
Oh, R.I.P. P.D. Push the pedal. What am I stuck on? Nope. I don't think there's anything else we could do. Well, shoot. I just, I'd hate to have, like, you know, some life changing event going on here and we miss out on it because we were just. We gotta get out of here. Uh, I think we were going this way. I think when we get back to the Duchess's place. We're pretty much there. So this should be Godoy. Uh, Jacques Peru, sorry. Yeah. Well, let's get out of here. Cool. Nope. There's nobody here. Got it. Oh, we'll go across here then. Hmm. All right. This is it. All right. Now's the time to join Mortimer. I won't be able to go back after. Here we go. Oh crap. Louis, hey. I was expecting you. Do you feel better? Hope yes, so. yes. Don't worry, I'll be all right. I wanted to speak with you about what's going to happen next. Uh -huh. But before we begin, I would like you to give me back the Holy Lance, please. Now that Gregory is gone, he won't be needing it anymore. And I prefer to put it back in its place. Uh... I no longer have it. Oh crap. Napoleon has got it. Difficulty 10. Wow. Of course. Here you are, Father. Huh. Thank you. You wouldn't have been able to do much with it anyway. Given it isn't the right one. You mean I got the wrong one? Now, don't blame yourself. There was a reason why I put it with all those copies. Uh, if you had been forced to use it, it would never have prevented one of us from changing bodies. This conference will have been one of the most eventful I've ever known. I'll just have to take your word for it. Before I get to why we're here, you must know that I've been watching you very closely over past few days. Uh -huh. I won't hide the fact that I was disappointed with you for having taken so many risks with Jacques Peru. Look where it got you. You could have died. As far as the door of my crypt is concerned, it is a pity that you lost your hand while trying to open it. Yeah, I'd like you succeeded one. in telling the Hillsborough twins apart. Even for me, that wasn't an easy thing to do at first. I remain proud of what you achieved for me by falsifying that letter to the Pope on behalf of Piaget. Oh, yeah. Because I know that was not an easy task. But the important thing is that you escaped the worst with Volner, because he could have killed you when you were in the guise of Piaget. Yes, it was a bit touch and go. Which leads me to a chat about what I envisage for you now. You are the chosen one, Louis. Oh, the I one knew I've it. been waiting for all this time. Thank now, you, we I... We are going to be able to become one. Hmm, I, I don't quite follow you. Be proud of yourself, son, for you are the one I have chosen to be my next mortal coil. I, I, but what about me? Am I imagining things, or did he just tell me to my face that he's going to eat me? Yeah, Unfortunately, I think that's the case. no, you won't survive the transfer, but I want you to know that I only select my bodies from my own children. And that you are the one who has impressed me most. Ah, crap. Far from being my first time, as you can imagine. I didn't think it was possible to find a more promising son than dear Augustus. You can be very proud of yourself. W wait a second. Hang on. Do you realize what you're saying? Are you insane? Oh, come, come, my son. Let's not end everything on a bad note, please. Son of a bitch. He's not going to get away with this so easily. 
Well, he might, dude. I won't let you do it. What on earth are you thinking? That you'll be able to kill me? This is ridiculous, Louis. Calm down. Be reasonable. Aww. Don't fight. Crap. I won. Whoa, 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 whoa. What just happened there? Because he said I won. I do uh, whoa. Because a Lord Mortimer wouldn't say I won. Because he would have been like, nah, did it again. I feel bad about my mom and her sister. They're stuck in the ether. Well, crap. Von Volmer tightened his political and spiritual grip on King Frederick William. On the death of the king in 1797, Johann retired with his wife to his country estate in order to continue his work on his theological and alchemical thesis. Manuel Godoy's close relationship with Napoleon enabled him to claim a part of Portugal, as well as the protection of France upon the fall of the kingdom. He died in the company of his beloved mistress Pepita after recovering all his titles and properties. Napoleon Bonaparte continued his political and military rise until his self-proclamation as emperor. His excessive ambition would cost the lives of 1,700,000 Frenchmen and leave France poorer and weaker than ever before. Holy hell, Deported dude. Deported and imprisoned by the British on St. Helena Island, he died on the 5th of May, 1821, as an exile to general indifference. Whoa. During his second term, George Washington had to deal with a number of rebellions. He enraged public opinion by building close diplomatic links with Great Britain, which forced him to give up a third term in office. He retired to his country estate until his death, without being able to implement the annexation of the highly coveted Louisiana Territory. The Duchess, through her relationship with the Crown, made it possible for Great Britain to build closer links to the United States, on both the diplomatic and the commercial fronts. She became inseparable from the Marchioness Cunningham, reputed for being the most influential mistress of King George IV of England, and whom she inducted into the Golden Order. His Eminence Piaggi, having successfully accomplished his mission, returned to His Holiness the Pope with full honors. Although all his ambitions had become possible, to the stupefaction of his entourage, the Cardinal preferred to retire to his Tuscan monastery, far from all political and diplomatic commitments. Fascinated by the techniques of exorcism and demonology, he dedicated the last years of his life to the study of Inquisition reports. On his return to Paris, Peru gave himself up to his peers of the revolutionary courts. He admitted to being implicated in several state corruption cases, found guilty of treason toward the Republic, he was executed without a trial. Oh, damn. Nothing more was ever heard of Lord Mortimer. His sudden disappearance was a topic of conversation in the European courts, but only for a few months. Yeah, I see, something's fishy. And then what about me? Hmm? Holy crap! I actually failed the whole freaking thing! <laughs> I was possessed by Mortimer and did not take the Alizif back to the continent. I failed to kill Lord Mortimer and I failed to leave the island safe and sound. Well, damn! I don't like that. That sucked. I wonder. Yeah, we have nothing else to equip because we haven't found any of those, so... Uh, whoops. Ah, 
It's all right, son. Don't panic. It's over. Uh, I'm back? Where are the guests? I invited them to go. They're ready. Gregory? We he's did now. I said, what? I, yep, I didn't. Did. Can't you? Did, 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 but I, you see, did, did, did. therefore, I am an ancient, Louis. What happened in the ether? I surpassed him. Uh. What do you mean you surpassed him? I made sure he was poisoned by my blood before our little chat. Remember the cup of tea in yeah. the dining room? I wagered that Gregory simply wouldn't be able to let it get cold. Old habits do die hard. You put your blood in your tea? And he put the hangman's rope round his own neck. Ironic, isn't it? Unable to extract himself from his physical body, it didn't take much time for me to absorb him. Okay, in any case, sense. what's done is done. I'm going to rest in the dining room. Join me there when you're ready. The time has come to end this little antisocial gathering. I See, I wonder if I should use that. Didn't I? Come on, let's get it over with. And join Mortimer in the dining room. Okay. Um. We are not going to be able to find anything. I'm going to try to see if I can use that freebie one. And see... See what happens here. We're going for it again. Yeah, I want right. to see if I can kind of dispute Mortimer. this. I won't be able to go back after. Here we go. No, we didn't talk to Von Volner, which is fine. Because I'm just trying to see if we can actually do something here. Louis, do you? Yeah, I, but, but now I no longer have it. Okay, so this is a free use. I put it back in its place. Mm. He has an immunity to that, so we'll Didn't give it Monsieur to Monsieur Bonaparte give it back to you? No. So, the rascal stole it from you, did he? Uh, it's not something I'm proud to admit, but yes. He thought I was trying to rob you and that it would compromise the conference. Oh, how typical of him. This conference will have been one of the most eventful I've ever known. All right, so I'll this might just have be... to take your word for it. Before I get to why we're here, you must know that I've been watching you very closely over these past few days. I won't hide the fact that I was look where as far as you see, even for I remain proud of but the important uh, thing. Yes, it was which leads me to a ch you, the one I've thank you. I... Hmm, I, I don't quite follow you. Be proud you. of yourself, son, for you. I... Right, but am I imagining? Unfortunately, no. It's far from. I didn't think it was. Okay. Are you insane? Uh, let's not end everything on a bad note, please. Son of a bitch! Stab him. Let me get away with this so easily. I won't let you do it. What on earth are you thinking? That you'll be able to kill me? This is ridiculous, Louis. Come now, be reasonable. Uh oh. Uh, it's free by consuming a double thorn. Don't fight. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't do anything. I won. Hmm. I want to see something here. Ah, oh, man. Because I don't remember how you activate the... Uh... See, like, we have all these... Uh, what the hell is it? These things. The purple ones. Not effort points, but the essence. Pushing all the buttons, that's all. So this isn't gonna work. Von Volner tightened his political and spiritual grip on King Frederick William. Huh. I'm gonna have to go back. 
Hmm. I'm trying to figure out. No. I wonder where we would have to go back to. You know what? I'm going to call this here. You guys let me know if you want to try to see the other ending. And if that's the case, I'll do it during a live stream. I'll go back and play 14, 15, and 16. We know how to complete them all. Uh, shouldn't take us too long, I don't think. Um, but you guys let me know. I might just do it off camera on my own. And uh, see if I can figure out what the hell happened. Or if I can even do it. Because I don't want to end up going all the way back to here to correct something that I need to do up here. Because if I go back here, I have to go back and do all these with the new choices, which I don't mind doing. But again, I don't think I would put you guys through doing it all on the same, like a, a live stream or through YouTube. So if you want me to go back to the final vote and replay these last three and see if we can get a different outcome, leave a comment down below and let me know. Uh, it might take a couple weeks for me to do or by the time you guys actually see this, I may have already done it. I'm not sure. We'll see how it goes. But everybody, I got to say thank you very much for all the love and support on this series. It's been absolutely freaking awesome. You guys are all amazing. And I will see you all in the next series. And make sure you guys go over and check out Call of Cthulhu if you like this one. Because it's very similar. And a lot of uh, occultism and darkness in that one as well. Take care.